Let's get back to the nasty nigga news, bro. I remember, I don't know if I got my time correct, but I remember, I'm just going to throw this out there. Probably around like 2014, 2015, that's when nasty nigga news had the city going crazy, bro. Once you, once you start doing nasty nigga news, I remember like... That was the height. Like, you had people sending you anonymous stories for you to post. You were uh, just all different type of stuff. Like, so just kind of give us, like, an insight of, like, why did you start that and just re everything that you remember around that time, bro. I was, I was a coach. Remember. I was a coach yeah. for the PKZ. You was the light of the city around that time. I was a coach right? for the PKZ. You know what PKZ is? No, what is Pam Mo Kids, though. Okay. We okay. had a little team play T ball. I had a team, me and Sin. They got us, you know, if you ain't had no felony in seven years, and you can go get this, you know, thing with the city, and I help coach the little kids, like Pop Warner football. Right. So, at the, some kids ain't make the team. So somebody got mad. I don't know how it got in it, but I got into an argument with a sister. And the sister went to selling me out, saying I'm fucking all the little kids on the team, posting all this here. So... I didn't know what they were posting it on Instagram. I ain't know nothing about Instagram. I was on MySpace. Right. So I went to sell it in the pump and back out, and the pump was small. This bitch had done came by my house and took pictures of me out there cleaning up the yard, and then say I sent him the pictures. You know how I, <laughs> it was all crazy, but it was all fun at the same time. You know what I'm saying? So make a long story short, I said, y'all, this some this some shit. I'm about to go. I'm about to start some shit. Y'all make me a page. I want to call that bitch nasty nigga new. I'm going to talk the nastiest shit that's going on in the city and make everybody know about it. Yeah. So I started off with people breaking in the houses around here. You know what I'm saying? And then I went to another thing. Then I started telling all women, if your man cheat and you want me to find out for a small fee, I'll let you know.